are you guys trying to find out the best way to get magical eggs in Prodigy? Well, if you are, you guys have come to the right place because you have clicked on one Dr. Genius's video on how to get magical eggs very quickly in Prodigy. Right, guys? So it's me, your host, one Dr. Genius, and let's hop on straight into our video. Alright guys, so as you know, the Festival of Spitting Fest has arrived, and with that we've gotten a new limited time currency available to us called Magical Eggs, right? And now you may be wondering, well, hum, it's been about a day since Spring Fest came in. I must know how to collect an unlimited and absurd amount of Magical Eggs. And well, you guys have clicked on the right video, because let's get straight to that. Alright guys, so number one, we're starting off with the most obvious thing, which is to do the daily quest. Now, what is the daily quest, you may ask? Well, glad you asked. You see this dancing star? Click on it. It basically tells you that there are magical eggs hidden around the place, and the Puppet Master's minions have been trying to get to it. You get to it, beat up those monsters, steal the magical eggs, and sell it overpriced to those wizards. Sell it overpriced to Don Zoro or the bunny. Right, yeah, that's basically what you do. So the first thing which you guys can do is you can search around Lamplight Town for his magical eggs, right? This is the first thing which you guys can do. Now obviously this gives you 10 magical eggs in one battle, which is an extremely good bargain if you guys ask me. I mean 10 magical eggs, one battle, that's, that's like the equivalent of 10 battles actually, right? Now over here it seems like we're it seems like we're going on a lucky spree and we found our magical eggs with absolutely no problem out. So let's click on it, obliterate the monster, try and steal these eggs, and then continue on forward. Like, why not? Wizard battle! And it seems like an unfortunate flame caller has dared stepped in our path, so now we shall destroy him with the entire force of a falling star. Because why not? Alrighty guys, we are casting our spell and half of the pet's health is gone, so I will be back once the pet is being terminated. Alright guys, now you can see our opponent's pet is at the brink of extinction, so let's just cast another spell and terminate this monster and steal the 10 magical eggs. Huzzah! We've casted our last spell, finishing off the monster, so now we can collect ourselves our 10 magical eggs and move on to our next strategy. And after opening the chest, you guys can see we get ourselves 10 magical eggs. Which is pretty cool if you guys ask me. Alright guys, so that is the first way to get magical eggs. And if you guys go back to Lamp Light Town, you guys will notice that my magical eggs have gone up by 10, right? Yeah, let's just check the amount of magical eggs we have right now. We have 36 magical eggs, meaning we had 26, right? So yeah, it went up by 10. Now the next method which you guys can use is by spinning the Twilight Wheel and the Wheel of Wonders. Now you may be wondering what happens from spinning these wheels. Well, there's a chance that magical eggs may appear on the wheel. And when you spin the wheel, there's a chance you might get 25 magical eggs. And you guys might be wondering, well, where's the proof? Well, I don't know if the wheel, if the eggs are up on the wheel right now. And if they're not, well, then here's um, a video from um, Spring F Summerfest. But then here's a video from Summerfest showing that we got 25 sand dollars from spinning the wheel. So there is always a chance that there might be a magical egg on their twilight wheel and you guys can get 25 of the currency. Now over here, unfortunately, it seems like that's not the case, so we'll have to like move on, right? So yeah, make sure you spin, go make sure you go spin both wheels, give them a good spin, see if you can get the magical eggs. If you can't, and if you fail your second chance, well, it happens, right? So yeah, now that's the second method which you guys can use. Now the third method you guys can use anywhere in the world of Prodigy. Anywhere, this method can be used anywhere and an unlimited amount of times, right? Anywhere, and the way you guys can use this method is by battling any sort of monster, right? Just select the location you want to go to, click play, find a monster, beat up monster, take magical eggs, and boom! There you guys can see your magical eggs go by one, right? So you just have to continuously defeat monsters. Right over here you guys get- oh my god! Oh my god, I feel so bad for this unfortunate hog which continuously gets smacked or need by me in order to show you the test, right? So now we'll quickly defeat off this monster, collect the magical eggs, and yeah, move on forward. Die. Hurrah! Another question answered correctly and another 5,000 damage dealt, meaning our unfortunate opponent has almost been defeated in an instant, right? So we can cast one more spell and show you guys that this is always true no matter which battle you choose. 
Alrighty guys, we're casting our final spell needed to finish off our opponent's monster. Here we go, monster defeated, and yeah, let's collect the magical eggs. So basically now, magical eggs appear after every single battle which you guys can finish, right? Now, the amount of magical eggs depends on how many monsters you battle. Right, like over here we battled one monster and defeated it, so we get one magical egg. You guys may battle two monsters and defeated two magical eggs, three monsters, three magical eggs, right? It goes by that. Maybe you defeated the boss, well congratulations, you only get one magical egg. So that's basically how it works. It depends on the number of entities which you have defeated and yeah. Now our next method is not so known. Now our next method has something to do with the drum roll please. Dino Dig Oasis is useful for a few things, right? And one of them is getting currency. Now you may be wondering, what? How do we get currency from Dino Dig Oasis? Well, that's the thing. You guys know the minigame Dino Dig. Well, if you guys go around in the minigame and go digging after you've completed the entire museum or something, you guys will notice that if you go dig around, eventually you'll get currency of the same area, right? Now basically, this completely depends on how lucky you are or how unlucky you are. So yeah, let's just start. Yeah, so basically this just completely depends on your luck. Like if you guys have too much money in Prodigy and just want to get rid of it or something, this is a good way to do it, right? You guys can tell, you aren't guaranteed the money all the time, but this is a good way to get rid of your money if you want. <laughs> yeah, so basically you have to spend an entire minute digging around hopefully in order to get stuff. Now over here it seems like we might have gotten some relic coins. We have a fossil? What? Hold up, what account am I on? So yeah, basically in order for this to work effectively, what you guys need is you basically need it to be like, um... Yeah, you basically need your museum complete if you guys want this to work. Yes. Yes! I have found it! And we shall get an additional 15 seconds! 10 years of furious clicking later. Right, 15 seconds have been added, so now our timer is at... Ew. Oh! Okay, it seems like I'm getting extraordinarily lucky right now, so let's just dig this up and see what we can get. Yeah, you guys will only get the reward of currency once you have actually defeated the area, right? Like, finish off the museum, then you guys get the currency. Can it be? No! Oh! Alright guys, you can't see my face right now, but right now if you guys could see my face, it is currently in that like, what? We just found it right when we were digging. So you guys can tell, basically this method completely depends on if you have finished the museum. If you have not finished the museum, then what are you expecting? You're gonna get fossils, and a lot of them. Right, so yeah, that's another way to get magical eggs in Prodigy. Now, I hope you guys found this video informational and figured out how to get magical eggs in Prodigy from all around the world. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up if you guys haven't already. Share it with your friends if they're also figuring, if they're also trying to figure out how to get magical eggs. And yeah, I will be catching you all next time. One Doctor Genius out the house. Bye and have a good time. Time to obliterate the Titan. Dun dun dun.